Hi, my name is Lynn Butler and welcome to the Nelson Bay Croquet Club. Uh, our courts are just outside Nelson Bay in the Tomaree Sports Complex. We moved to these dedicated facilities just over 10 years ago, but since then um, the number of members has more than doubled. We've had to double the number of playing sessions. We now have to play six days a week. Um, some days we have sessions morning and afternoon, but in spite of all this, we're still having to play on half courts. And that's not the way the game's meant to be played. It's like playing tennis on half court tennis. We're limited in not being able to host events because we only have the two courts and therefore we can't invite lots of other clubs to come along and join us. We've also had to stop actively recruiting. We just really can't take any more members. Um, we'll never turn anybody away who comes and approaches us of their own accord, but we're not holding come and try days. We're not advertising anywhere because we can't take the extra numbers. There are 69 croquet clubs in New South Wales and Nelson Bay Croquet Club is the sixth largest. But in terms of uh, the ratio of number of members to the number of courts, we're the third worst. In the grand scheme of things, there are quite a few things the club would like. We've got a tin shed as a clubhouse and it's very hot in summer and cold in winter, so we'd love to have better facilities. We don't have toilets on site. We have to walk across to the nearby Oval to use their facilities. And our storage shed is an old second-hand container. But in spite of this, the number one priority for members is additional courts. We'd love all the other things, but the first thing that has to be done is to get those additional courts. Then we'll start addressing our other needs. Master plan for the whole of the Tomaree Sports Complex was developed, and in that, provision was made for two additional courts right next to our existing ones. The funds for the project will be used to move the existing road between the car parks further across towards the Oval and the Rugby Club and then we'll need the soil filled in and flattened out and topsoil put on and then the grass for the courts on top of that. We had the full support of Port Stephens Council and Tomaree Sports Council to build the additional courts. They recognise the need for this given that 42% of people are over the age of 55 whereas for the rest of Australia it's only 27%. We are a retirement area. Look our croquet, the way we play it. Look how croquet should be played. 